Hey movie lovers, I'm Alan. Welcome to Real Movie Grid. Dean Norris has hair and Don Draper gets a new job. Today I'm reviewing Beirut. So Beirut, um, the screenplay, uh, the pace timing, and the casting slash uh, performance were all the areas that really brought this movie down. The screenplay, though there wasn't any superfluous, unnecessary plots that distracted from the main plot, they didn't use that gain time to the gained time from not having those plots in it, like in most movies. They didn't use that to de develop the. Uh, the main characters motivations or any of the other supporting characters it really didn't there were a lot of things going on with each of those characters but they just kind of mentioned mentioned those things that were in their lives and didn't didn't explain where their motivations came from um the the performance overall i mean john ham played Dr don draper he played he played 90 87 percent of don draper um and the rest of it, you know, he was slightly a more moral guy in this movie, but he's pretty much the same character. Um, Dean Norris has hair. It's a little weird to look at because, you know, you're not used to that. Um, I, I'd say the highlights for this movie, though, were the uh, the design with the, the costuming the and the landscape. It was just amazing. Um, it really did look like and feel like a, uh, a war in the uh the the late 80s um or late 70s and early 80s um it it felt great uh so that they did a really good job in that department um and then the uh the the audio is pretty good um and and the uh the 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 cinematography both those things did pretty well uh there's a lot of really cool shots that added to the the feeling of oh we're in a, in a war war zone that there's a little bit of normal life going on so it felt, you know, it put you on the edge of your seat uh, pretty often. And then the the audio added to that same effect. Um, I, I was unwowed. And uh, for the genre, I called it a historical fiction. Um, it was, the, the script was very tropey. So when you move that into the, into the, the category, the genre, I would say that that helped, that brought down the, um, the category or the genre for me because people don't actually talk like talk in tropes um there are definitely a lot of situations in this movie where you're like okay i know it's gonna happen now it's gonna demonstrate how how awesome don draper is or whatever his character's name was um and it, it takes away from the historical part of the the movie for me thanks again for watching subscribe hit the bell for notifications find us on facebook and twitter and join in the comments below and let us know what you think on how we can improve the real movie grade system <laughs> what are you an auctioneer Hey, don't forget to watch the playlist to my left, What is Real Movie Grade? It's going to help you better understand the real movie grade system.